Hey everyone, it's Norma here with Orange Lingerie and thanks for joining me for today's tutorial. Today we are going to be talking about how to accurately cut out your pattern pieces. This is particularly important when you are working with very small pattern pieces to make a very fitted garment and you're using the edge of the fabric to determine your seam line. All of these things apply when you're making bras, which is why I am so excited to show you how to cut accurately today. So let's get started. First, we need to cut out our pattern pieces, and you can see that the outline of the pattern piece is about 1 16th of an inch thick. We need to cut that off as we cut out our pattern pieces. So let's get the rest of the Boylston bra pattern pieces cut out and notched to prep for cutting from fabric. I'm going to speed up this video a little bit. Now we can lay out our pattern pieces onto our fabric to prep for marking. With our pieces laid out, we can now trace their outline and notches onto the fabric. We will be using these marked lines to guide our cutting. Once again, I'm gonna speed this up a little bit. I wish I were this fast. Now when we cut out the pattern pieces, we are going to cut off that chalk outline. Here I take long, smooth strokes with my shears to remove the chalk outline.
Once again, I'm going to speed things up as I cut out the rest of the Boylston bra pattern pieces from the fabric. Normally, I would not advise lifting your fabric up off the table like I just did. Most fabrics cannot tolerate that. However, I'm using here a fabric called Duoplex, which is a very durable Trico fabric, and I know that it will not be affected by me picking up to cut out the pieces. If this were a silk or a satin, I certainly would want to keep the fabric flat on the work surface for cutting. So how accurate is this cutting technique? Let's take a look. So on the left, I have a piece that I traced and then cut out, and on the right, a piece that I pinned and then cut out. When I put the trace piece on top of the piece that I pinned and cut, you can see they're not the same. You can see there's a little extra fabric around the outside of the pinned and cut piece. A little hard to see here. Let's lay the pattern piece on top of the pinned and cut piece. And now it's much more obvious. You can see that the fabric is quite a bit larger actually. And you know, these little differences multiplied over several small pattern pieces are going to add up. Here's a piece that I chalked and cut and you can see, well, you can't see any fabric on the outside of the pattern piece. It's very accurate. And so there you have it. That is the best way to accurately cut out your sewing pattern. Now you are set up for sewing success at the machine. The pieces will come together beautifully and you will be sewing up the size that you want to be sewing. Enjoy. So thanks for joining me for today's tutorial. If you like this tutorial, be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so you can see more videos just like this one. Till next time.